I'm going to show you some of the advanced features around keyword tracking within Gummy Search. So your track keywords, they can be found right here on your conversations page. You can see I have four of them. And uh, you can make a new one by making a search in the advanced uh, search page or from any of your audiences. So let's say that I run a SaaS product that is a SEO audit tool. I can go ahead and make that search, see all the results. And let's say this is something that I want to track and be notified of when there are new conversations that meet this, uh, that meet this keyword criteria. I can go ahead and press this track button and track it. And you can see now lights up green says that I am tracking it. Um, now I'll be notified of any new conversations and I can hop in and plug my tool or interact with people that um, could be potential customers. So in the conversations, uh, so when I have a new match for uh, some of my tracked keywords, you can see there's a little green icon right here that tells me about it. Um, and the track keyword that does have any matches in this new matches section. Um, I'll, I'll, if you have uh, email digest enabled, then you'll also get that notification to your, to your email. So I can then just go ahead and click on it, see the new conversation um, within, uh, within this track keyword. Looks like someone's asking for this recommendation. I can go ahead and you know click reply to go out to Reddit and view it, um, or just read the comments from right here. Now, a couple of things about the uh, track searches, they get better as you interact with the conversations that are surfaced to you. And what you can see when you press stats is all the stats around your um, your views, your clicks, how efficient these conversations are, how frequently they happen. And the goal here is to make sure that you get less noise and more signal. And you can prune out the conversations that um that you're tracking that might not be worth it and focus on the ones that uh, do provide you results uh, what you can also do is you can also tag certain tracked uh, searches and so you can see right here i have uh, features um and i can go ahead and if you're if you're making a bunch of these searches then it's helpful to be able to um, tag them by label or maybe by the audience that you're searching in, by the keyword. Um, to tag something by label, I can go ahead and click right here, I label and I'll say uh, product category. And now you can see I have a product category label and this track keyword is within it. Another thing that's really useful uh, within uh, the track searches is um, you'll notice when you look at the conversations for all of your uh, results, you're going to see um, either this eyeball, if you view this conversation on Gummy Search, or this click icon. Um, and this way you can make sure that you don't miss anything um, and you can even filter it down if you just want to go ahead and look at the ones that are completely new to you that you haven't read the contents of, then you can do that right here. Additionally, um, you can get notifications of your tracked searches by uh, going to your account settings, go to notifications, and by default, you're going to get the notifications to your email. But you can also configure a, a Discord webhook or a Slack email address so that it goes directly to where you and your team. Um, are already chatting and everyone can see the results of the new keyword mentions that uh, that you get. So those are the track searches. Um, I have some blog posts about what keywords are useful to track. Um, I recommend setting up you know five to ten of them and then uh, pruning the ones that are not as effective um, and focusing on the ones that are. So yeah.